Hey YouTube, well, what's going on? TuneK here, back again with a, another episode of Jack and Daxter, the Precursor Legacy gameplay. So in the last episode, we did the Lava Tube, and now we're in the Golamaya Citadel to take him on. Let's go free all the sages now. It's about time you two decided to show up. Nice to see you, too. Do they have you mopping the floors now? There's no time for jokes, Daxter. Gaul and Maya kidnapped us to sap our energies to power their abominable machine. It appears they have combined the functional remains of a precursor robot with scavenged artifacts from across the land. Then they added a few diabolical additions of their own, creating the one thing capable of opening the dark eco silos. If you can free the four of us, we can use our combined powers to break the force shield surrounding the robot before they use it to destroy the world. Okay, so the first uh, power cell, uh, I'm sorry, Skullfire is right there. Uh, we want to get over here. We, we, so, in the Citadel, we have to free all the, ow. Why are there even lurkers here? This is a Citadel, I don't get why they have lurkers. Anyway, what we want to do is get all of these precursor orbs uh, as much as we can because we do want to collect everything in the game uh, and get all the skull flies too because that's mostly important. Getting all the skull flies is very important. Uh, here's another one right here that we're going to be getting. Let's show that. And then we would just come over here. Uh, you have to stand on these little things. Yeah, there we go. Uh, I don't think we're gonna be able to get. Maybe we can get these. Not that I know of. I believe. Yeah, there's the. Uh, I think that's the red sage. If I'm looking at it correctly. But um. Let's have a look around here. Okay, so this is the giant precursor robot that we will be fighting. It's the final boss of the game. I, I, there's only three bosses in this game, which sucks, but... You'll be meeting the uh, red sages later on if... Okay, we didn't get those precursor orbs, so we're gonna try getting those again. Okay, let's try getting that precursor orb again. If we can. Okay. That's not what I wanted to do, but let's just get over with it. Okay, let's see where we want to go now. Do we want to free the blue sage first or the red sage? I don't know who I'm going to be saving first. There's only three sages. Um, let's go over here. Because I do believe that the uh, there's something we could do over here. So let's just see what we could do. Uh, I hear a scout fly, but I don't know where that could be. Oh, it's right here, and oh, I hate this area. Oh, I actually hate this area. Ooh, but free precursor swords, though. Okay, so I actually, I really hate this area. Because we have to land on the launchers. We have to be careful about our precursor orb and power cells.
Okay, there we go. We got that. I think we got all the curse orbs in this room, maybe. Ah, oh, come on. There's a thing right there. Okay, no, I'm killing myself, so I don't have to, uh... Okay, I'm gonna get all those Bicker Swords because there's all of them right there. Okay, thankfully I know what to do now since we can have all the uh, Blue Eco, thankfully. some bull crap right there. I hate this area so much. I don't want to waste your guys' time on this mission because this mission can be pretty dumb, I would say. Well, I hate the Citadel because of how stupid it is. I really hate this part because, uh, okay then, that didn't really work. Let's see what I could do. So, all right, let's get that thing and let's get over here. I don't know how I missed out on that, but let's just see what I can do here. I do want to have enough blue ego just so I can make it to the thing. Come on, that was, I honestly hate this area. I might have to skip the Precursor Orbs in this area, maybe. Because uh, I want to like get this area done. It's not that much of a big... It <sighs> I hate this so much. Anyway. I might have to like cut ahead because the area is like... I don't know, I like this game so much, but there's so many puzzles you have to do, and it's just so irritating because they're puzzles and it's like so irritating that you literally have to do everything. And it's just so annoying that you have to do it all, otherwise you won't make it. Okay, I might get this done if I can land on it. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. Maybe. Maybe. Don't. There we go. Okay, I did it. And Fred Sage. Here we go. Let's free him. Oh, Yellow Sage. I'm going to give Gall and Maya a little payback for this embarrassment. And we'll see you about cooking up some muskrat stew. Thank you. 
<clears throat> anyway, let's free all the uh, two other sages, three other sages. We have to free red sage, uh, blue sage, red sage, and green sage, and then free uh, the uh, seven scout flies that we have to do. Wait, what's this over here? Uh, let me find out what's this over here real quickly. <sighs> You're kidding me. That's bull. Anyway, we're gonna go over here. Oh, come on! Is that something you can't go over there or something? Can you not go over there or something? Like, I'm, you can, it just don't let you because you're gonna fall over for some reason. What? You're gonna get stuck either way. I I really wonder what is over there. Okay, never mind, never mind. I'm not gonna go over there because that's just a waste of time. Anyway, let's get back over here and I think we can get these parts. Uh, because orbs, never mind. We can't get them. Okay, that's just stupid me, I guess. Um. But yeah, we freed the, the yellow sage. I have to free the other sages that apparently are troubled from Gol and Maya, so we went over that area, right? Yeah, we did. Okay, good. Um, let's see, where else can we go? I don't think... Oh, I don't think we can get... Yeah, we can't get those because of orbs yet. So... Let's go over here because I think this is the red sage that we're gonna go through uh, freeing, so... Let's make a go! Oh yes, this is an area I'm most likely gonna hate. Um... It's pretty crazy because you have to like uh, jump on this over here and it spins around for some reason but you also have to jump right here also watch out for that beam I don't know why it's doing that for some reason but let's just get over there yeah you want to watch out for that And then what you want to do is you want to jump over here, because there's light, there's light, there's a blue eco that you want to like activate for yourself. There we go. Let's maybe just see something. So, I'm sorry for the pausing, I'm just looking at stuff. Anyway, let's do this, because there's precursor orbs we can get, so let's get these. And there's a uh, scuff fly that we can get. Nice. Uh, that's pretty much everything, I think. Yeah. Oh, you're kidding me. Come on. Oh, I have to go all the way back there for dying. Come on. I hate this so much. I never usually die unless if it's something really hard to do. 
but I know that it's not really that hard for me to die in this game. But even though I can die a lot just because um, how stupid the game can be. Are you kidding? I thought I could make that. Brr. I'm not wasting any more time on this. I just want to get everything as soon as I can. I really hate this part. Ow. Am I... Thing is running for the reason. Anyway, let's just... Go over here. Watch out for those little tractor beam thingies because they will hurt you. You want to light these things up with blue eco because that's how you want to do it. I also want to have enough blue ego just to activate this for more precursor orbs. And then we're here the free blue sage. hundred power cells and then we'll be uh, done with the uh, power cells as you can see there's the yellow sage doing his business um, so I don't think we'll be able to get those precursor orbs maybe somehow uh, oh wait maybe we can hold on maybe we can um, Maybe we can? I don't think so. Can, can we not get those because orbs? I'm pretty sure that's the red sage. So how do we get to the red sage? Oh, right. Yes. Uh, I don't think I've done this one. So we have to get over to the red sage by doing this. Ignore the noises in the background, by the way. Anyway, uh... So as we're going over here... trying to get every precursor orb I can uh, just because I don't want to like miss out on the uh, precursor orbs okay did I get all the precursor orbs I think I did did I let me just have a look just to be sure Okay, yeah, I did. Okay, anyway, let's go over here to activate Yellow Rico because we have more Picker's Orbs to collect. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. It's an ambush of lurkers. Yeah, so what you basically want to do here is, like, destroy their spawn rate because they have a lot of spawners. And there's also Red Eco that we can use to, like, to, to make our powerful attacks a bit better. Uh... We could just like do this and uh, 
you basically won't get attacked. We're kind of basically invincible right now, I would say. We're kind of basically invincible <laughs> to this right now. And then we got the ready go. You can basically do this to them. But uh, here's their spawners that you can actually break. Uh, Uh, let me just make sure that's all the curse orbs that we've gotten for as I know because uh, I like the red eco. I like the blue. We're actually we're actually gonna be using the yellow eco for the uh, final boss fight because it's a giant robot and we have to shoot like our fireballs at the uh, yellow eco guy or at the uh, robot sorry for the spoiler but that's what basically we're gonna be doing but that's gonna be for that next episode so i hope you guys are ready for that next episode is the uh, final boss fight okay that just oh you're sh you're kidding me right Oh come on, do I have to get through on all that again? Oh come on, do I have to go through that again? Do I? Wait. No I don't. I don't think I do, do I? No I don't. Good, because I have to show their spawner, so I could just go back here. No. And then we can just get over here, perfect. <laughs> you finally come to rescue. Do you know how long I've been in here? What took you so long? Enough. <laughs> what are your names? I'm Dexter. Who's Jack? Good job, Daxter. You're a real hero. You've got to stop Gaul from launching the robot. I'll use my eco power to help open the shield door. <laughs> Oh, the platforms? What platforms? Oh yeah, right, those platforms. Right. But wait, don't we have to, uh... Yes, pick our swords are down here, so... Wait, am I missing a few, uh... I think I'm missing a few... Hold on. I don't think I'm missing scout flies, am I? Uh... I need it? Huh. Let's just see what happens when we climb these things, because I'm pretty sure... I don't think I'm missing a lot of scout flies. But uh, this is the platforms that we have to use to free Samos, or where we're going to, or we are going to free Samos, or uh, Kira's uh, f daughter, or father, yeah Kira's father. No scout fly up here. Weird. Uh, am I missing a few scout flies? Oh, I don't think I'll be able to get 100 power cells. Wait, maybe I will uh, when I free Samos, but... Oh, God. Uh, I, am I somehow missing a few scout flies? I don't think I am, am I? That's just weird if I am, because I, I don't recall me missing a few scout flies. Oh, f Oh come on, of course I fell. Um, okay, that's just weird because I don't know if I'm really missing a few scuff. That's just really weird to me because I, I, I don't know if I am missing a f two more scuff flies. Like, I'm pretty sure I got all of them that I could, right? Huh. That's 
really random, but uh, okay, I, I guess that'll have to do. I mean, I think I'll just get another Paracel when I free the Green Sage, because I'll just have exactly 100. So it doesn't really make a big deal out of it, really, so... Unless if I do get all the Picard Swords in this place with, uh, by going over here, maybe, then I'll, I'll see, but... It's just really weird, because... I, I don't know what else I could be missing, like, I'm pretty sure I scattered throughout this entire place, right? Like, unless there's somehow Precursor Orbs in this, uh, place that I'm missing, then... Like, this place is not really that big, it's really just a Citadel that I'm somehow... Oh, here's a few Precursor Orbs, but I think I'm missing a few Scout Flies, really. Yeah, there's a scout fly I'm missing. So what scout fly could I be missing? Well, I got 2,000 Bacursa orbs, but where's the last scout fly? Oh, whatever. I'm gonna, I have 100 power cells. I'll just look for the scout fly later. At least I have 100 power cells. That's what I was going for. Good work, boys. You're real heroes now! I'll combine my green eco-power with the other three sages, and together we'll open the shield door surrounding the Precursor robot. Yeah, yeah, that sounds like a good start. And then after you guys open that shield, what are you gonna do about the robot? Nothing, Daxter. We have to keep the shield open. It's up to you two to figure out how to destroy the robot. Oh, great. I get to help the guy that turned me into a furball destroy the only person who can turn me back! First, save the world. Then we'll try to convince Gaul to help Daxter. You're too late to save us. Once I possess limitless dark ego, I will have a key to creation itself. This is madness! Releasing that much Dark Eco would destroy everything we know! Just look what it's done to you! It has given us a beauty beyond anything you could understand. Beauty? Have you two looked in the mirror lately? Just wait until we open the silos, little one. You think short and fuzzy is bad. And to think you two travel all this way for my help. Fools! Enjoy your front row seats to the recreation of the world! Jack! Take the elevator up and stop that robot! Well, guys, we're gonna end today's episode because the last episode, the next episode is we're gonna be defeating that robot. I don't know how I didn't free all the seven scout flies, even though I think I have gotten every. Si At least I have over 100 power cells and I have over 2,000 Bakersa orbs. Yay! So, um. We're gonna end today's episode. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you guys think. We freed all the sages, and uh, we're, and then the next we're gonna go destroy the next that robot, which is the final boss. We came all this way. We're gonna have a hundred power cells. And then the next episode is the finale. Of Jack and Daxter, the Precursor Legacy because man, Jack and Daxter, the Precursor Legacy was such a fun ride. Thank you guys for coming with me on this journey. It's been quite a lot of fun. I really like this game. Let me know if you guys want to see the Jack and Daxter 2, which I'm really looking forward to after I beat this. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed. The last episode, the next, the next and final episode will be the finale of me defeating the robot. So, hope you guys enjoy. Let me know what you guys think, and I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.